How's it going, fellow Hearthstoners? My name is Christophe Source, and today we're going to be playing Emo Girlie's Mech Priest. The beatings are available, or beatings available, because <laughs> that's what the repair bot says. So we're going to go ahead and, um, I think we're going to actually throw all this back. Yeti has four attack, which is nice, but I think it's more important, hey, look, we have to upgrade the repair bot. It's more important that we establish ourselves early on, so... I'm gonna go ahead and play this, a cleric, of course. And we can actually play a Noitron next turn, um, which I might even do even if he clerics, which is what I was going to say. Um, or I guess I could just attack and heal, maybe? Hmm. I don't know, I think it's better that we get the board established, so now if he attacks into it and heals, I'm still going to get a card draw. So we'll just go ahead and like let him do the card draw, rather. Oh, he's Mech Priest, too. Uh, there's like a lot of Mech Priests going around right now. Okay, so he can't even heal, unless it be coins, maybe? Okay, he's going to Power Word Shield, that's why. Okay. It's actually a better idea that he did that. Um... Yeah, it's like way better. So, I guess we'll just go ahead and do this. Because this still lives, too. And if we want to, which we're probably not going to, but if we want to, we can heal this next turn. But we're probably going to play a Shredder, honestly. Okay. I guess we're going to attack on that. Um, yeah, we'll probably just play this. And then go face. Now keep in mind we are the um, the emo girlies version which has mind blast so we might want to go face a little bit more than usual um, just because we're gonna have that burst potential I mean we don't have it in hand right now but we will have it at some point okay that's pretty good um, we'll probably just repair bot and what kind of sucks is we would love to cabal that right now but we're gonna have to just break through it. Yeah, so this still dies, which sucks, but oh wow, he's got to repair pot too. Oh man, <laughs> the value. Okay, um, I think we're gonna go ahead and just trade into this. Ooh, okay, um, I guess we can just steal it, maybe? Or, actually, you know what? Well, because hmm. we steal it, then trade. Or we can make him trade, and we could play another. And then this would still live. Um, yeah, I think I'm going to do that, just to kill this. I think that's a better choice. So he can kill this, probably. Or, oh, well, he could with the loot quarter. He can even um, Shadow Word Death. Okay, he has Holy Fire. Okay, so this might be the version that um, was playing before. Okay, so this turn's like alright, um, but we can at least heal this. This is a 5 6 now, so that's kind of cool. So now we have board dominance. Um, we will be sad though if he plays like light bombs, which most likely he does. Um, and hopefully he plays like a Noyatron soon. Okay, I guess we can still steal something. Or we can even Shadow Madness, I guess. Mm, actually, I think we're gonna... Hmm, so we steal that and go face, maybe? Yeah, I guess we can do that. That's fine. I think we'll play this too, I guess. We're just gonna go all out. If he has light bombs, pretty sad, but can't just keep playing around it. So it looks like he does have light bombs. Okay. Oh, never mind. Oh, maybe now he's gonna play light bombs? Yeah, okay. So yeah, he's just waiting to do it. 
But we still have this, so this is nice. And then he healed himself, so we get to punch him in the face. Holy Nova. Really not the card we were looking for, but okay. Um, guess we should have healed this. But if he plays Holy Nova to kill this, eh. It's not really that good, so. And next turn, we don't have lethal. So that kind of sucks. Balin's chosen, wow, okay. Well, at least we can Holy Nova and, um, actually we won't even kill it, huh? Okay, maybe if we would have hit that, we would have been able to kill it, but. We'll probably just use this though. And oh yeah, we actually have enough damage. Okay, so we win. Oh bam. Sweet. Yes, we did it. Okay, so a little worried here. Um wondering if we should actually keep You know what? I think I'm actually gonna keep Dr. Boom, and the main reason why I'm gonna do that is because we have such a nice curve, and getting into Dr. Boom is like pretty strong it's just like really annoying so this is a control warrior and we drop it turn seven it'll be nice because we already have it in hand and everything you know so um and we're actually going to play spider tank here just because we can bring out the other one next turn and um he doesn't have coin to death bite so this is going to be a little bit awkward for him and we just play this and he can just um fiery oh, okay he can shield slam though because I didn't really think about that, but that's fine if he shield slams that. Um, I guess we'll go ahead and should we play this. Yeah, I guess we'll just play this again. Um, even though now he can death bite, which kind of sucks. Yeah, actually, a death bite would be really bad here. So hopefully, he doesn't have it. Okay, cool. So I'm pretty sure this is a control warrior. But there's like a lot of different types of warriors going around right now, so. I'll go ahead and Yeti, um, because he can't death bite it. I mean, he can after he death bite with the death rattle, but. So hopefully we can get in enough face damage, because we already have the uh, mind blast, so that's nice. I'm not sure what he's going to do here. Maybe X whirlwind? Okay, so. He just kind of ran into it, which is a little bit awkward, but I guess that's fine. Um, hmm. yeah, I think we'll just heal this to kind of play around Brawl a little bit. I don't want to give him, because this is already like pretty good Brawl. Um, well, actually, no, it's not. <laughs> So, but with this, and I mean, I guess we could have played it. I don't know. Okay, so we didn't kill that. So we attacked him. Okay, that's really weird. I don't know what's going on right now. <laughs> um, ooh, an extra attack. That's pretty good. So we can go ahead and undo that. And trades. And I think we'll just bring out both of these. Alright, so, like I said, got the Mind Blast. That should trip him up a little bit. Next turn is Dr. Boom, most likely. Um, so that should be pretty nice. This buffs for extra health. Pretty cute. Cool. Um, question is, do we ignore that, or do we trade into it? Ah, heal lot. I'm really feeling like going face, honestly. So if he belchers, um, I'm pretty sure we're going to be able to kill him next turn. That's why I'm doing this, but not entirely sure if this is right, because he could brawl still. Um, but at least the bombs even. Yeah, so, okay, well now he can't even brawl anyway, so it doesn't matter. But he might whirlwind? Okay. Okay, cool. Yeah, so Dr. Balance. <laughs> you know. You know what it is. <laughs> Alright, guys. I'm going to go ahead and end the video right there. If you enjoyed this video and the little gameplay that I got, 
out of this. Um, I won both games, so that's kind of cool. Uh, go ahead and give us a thumbs up. I'll leave the deck in the description below for those of you seeing this through YouTube. You can actually go check out uh, Emo Girlie's deck guide. I'll have that, like I said, the link in the description below. And um, yeah, go rate it up. It's pretty cool. There's like another uh, mech on Hearthphone too for like the top decks. Um, but I think it really just depends on how you want to play. Because the Mind Blast can be like really aggressive but for this deck. And the other deck doesn't have them. But then the other deck has like more uh, control with the Light Bombs and such. So anyways, thanks guys for watching like always. And I hope to catch you in another video. Peace out.